Mr. Gandhi, you lead the Indy Alliance, which is seen by many as an alternative to the BJP-led NDA government. Looking at the 2024 Lok Sabha elections, your party was not able to agree on, on seat-sharing policies with your alliance partner, which was Mamta Banerjee's TMC. You also have alliance partners like the Hindutva-based Shiv Sena UBT. My question is, if elected, how will you effectively run a government with such a divided coalition that cannot seem to agree on anything except for the removal of Prime Minister Modi? No, actually, actually we, we agree on a lot. Um, we agree that the Constitution of India should be defended. Uh, most of us agree on the idea of the caste census. We agree that two business people, namely Mr. Adani and Mr. Ambani, shouldn't run every single business in India. So for you to say that we don't agree, I think uh, is inaccurate. Uh, second thing is that all coalitions are negotiations, right? So a certain amount of to and fro will always take place. That is perfectly natural. There's nothing wrong with it. And we have run governments again and again, which have been successful using coalitions. So we have, we're pretty confident that we can do it again. Thank you. And actually, uh, I think if we get it right, uh, We would, uh, yeah, sorry, it's not India Alliance. That's a BJP framing. It's India Alliance. What's the last word stand for? Uh, the, what does the A stand alliance. for at the end? So wouldn't it be redundant to stay India no, Alliance? No, 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 it's not. Because the, no, it's not. Because the whole idea, the whole idea of the alliance was to put across to the people of India that India is being attacked. And it was very successful. And, 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 and generally, the BJP people say India Alliance, but everyone else in India says India Alliance. 